Hello, friend Mormo here. Um, I got some art sales. I'm so stoked. It's been an amazing month of payments. And um, I had a really good month this month. And tomorrow I actually got a... Um, I got a thank you card and an envelope. I buy these cards at Dollar Tree. They're a dollar for like six of them. And they're Hallmark. I don't. I don't personalize my cards in case people want to sell the cards one day. They, if somebody want, wanted to flip my art, they could sell the card as well if they wanted to keep the card. That's why I don't personalize my cards. But, um, this person bought two items. This person bought two items, which is really awesome. I'm really, oh wait, no, that's not the right one. If I can find the right one. I'll just gather up all of my cards that haven't sold yet. Here's this piece of art that hasn't sold yet. Here's one, here's one. Okay, it's not that one. It's this one. This one sold the Dust Devil card. And I'm so stoked because I'm going to see my friend tomorrow, God willing. Um, and um, I made this card in their class, in their art class. I made this art card in their art class and um, so I'll, I'm really stoked now I can brag and say, oh I got my card sold from their art class. I'm gonna sign, She, the person also bought bought these prints, the um, CEO, the K-hole, and the Mormo print. She bought the Icy prints. I don't, should I sign the Icy prints? Yeah, what the hell, I'm gonna sign them. I'm, I'm gonna say, artist, Icy, Bird, Dealer, Mormo, Zine, Artist, Icy Bird, Dealer, Mormo Zine. And I'm going to talk to my caseworker, but I'm starting to put serious thought into becoming an art dealer. I might become a professional art dealer for my job. Since I'm dedicating this year to art, I might actually become 
a professional art dealer. So here, this person, it's a woman, she bought this card, this Dust Devil card that's mixed media. I made that at um, Crazy Critters Crafts. And, I, and it sold tonight. I'm so stoked about that. And this Icy Bird print. This Icy Bird print. And this Mormo print of CEO. And so I'm going to include all of that. I'll include a Swin dispensary sticker because if they are a Mormo fan then they probably know all about Swin Dispensary. Swin Dispensary is a character in the Mormo verse. It's part of my lore. So I'm going to send this person this woman Two more Mosin stickers as well. More Mo Zine. Right on. So I'll just include these two stickers as a bonus. And then um, I'm going to sign this photograph. Hold on. I'm going to um, get the scissors real quick. Because um, unfortunately I got to cut these photographs so that they fit in the envelope. But I'm gonna start a new club soon and I'll probably get some new photographs printed up for my club but first I gotta cut this photo I'm gonna cut a little bit off the side Let's see if it'll fit now. Nope, it won't fit. That was a really lame cut. Normally I love scissor work and I love using scissors. But cutting these photographs just sucks because I just don't like doing it. I'd rather not, but they don't fit otherwise. Right on. So now I got to sign the photo. More Mosin signed photo. I think I know who this is going out to and it's somebody who's been a real supporter. Sorry, this is a really long video. Yeah, this is going out to somebody who's been a real good supporter of my channel. And, uh, or actually, I think they just found my channel, but they're very supportive in chat. And that's really awesome. 
and I never licked the envelope post-COVID. I always use a piece of tape. on the envelope and I'm about to address it and stuff but click the link in the description if you want to see my eBay store I got some great deals and uh, you get lots of bonuses so click the link in the description and thanks so much